Hi there, today I am going to win the 430 dart challenge with my minigun, the Moab. If you don't know this challenge, Coop772, a well known nerf youtuber, took different blasters and tried to shoot them as fast as possible, measuring the time it took to shoot 430 darts. I started developing a fast shooting minigun two and a half years ago and it became my dream that one day Coop would test my own blaster in his challenge. I put around a thousand hours into developing my minigun. It took a lot of time, a lot of issues came up, and I kept myself motivated by the dream that my minigun would dominate his challenge and set a record that no one can beat that easily. Now my blaster is ready for the challenge, but sadly last week Coop announced that he will no longer make YouTube videos. That's why I will do the challenge for my minigun myself. Let's take a look at Coop's leaderboard. The currently fastest blaster is the Jupiter with proton pack, which needed only 22 seconds for the 430 darts. I want to beat that time. What do you think? Will it beat the record? The Moab uses, like a real minigun, the Gatling gun mechanics. It has six rotating barrels that each shoot darts. The darts are fed via a belt and are stored in the backpack. Okay, let's see how fast the Moab will be. I loaded up 430 darts. On the top right corner you can see the timer. Let's go. In case you're wondering what happened with my foot, the shells are ejected quite fast, they hit my foot and that just hurts. This might be annoying, but in early prototype it was way worse. <laughs> Here is a new leaderboard, the Moab crushed the record, more than half in the previous time. And it took only two years of my life and another hour to pick up and reassemble the belt again. But to really compare the performance of the different blasters, let us watch the challenges in parallel. First, in the bottom left corner, the previous record holder for one and a half years, the out of dance Jupiter with Proton Pack. If you take another look at the leaderboard, you can see that the first five blasters use rival balls. The fastest, more classic blaster with normal darts is the modified Rapid Strike. So this comes on the right side. And in the top left corner is the new champion, the Moab. Let's start. As you can see, the setup of my Moab is pretty optimal for this challenge. High firing rate, no reloading required and the belt disassembles itself when used, so you don't end up with a 10 meter long belt hanging out of the blaster. And yes, it's definitely overpowered, but you can reduce the rate of fire to 15 darts per second, so you can shoot for 30 seconds without reloading. But after that, reloading is pretty slow. So that was the 430 dart challenge for the Moab. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. If you did, subscribe and you will also get notified when I sell my mob number 2 via auction.